channel. So today I'm going to be giving you guys a two-part video. I don't know. I'm going to be doing my cleaning video. I did not get to upload it this weekend. Um, I'm filming in real time on Monday morning. So this video definitely will be going up late today. But I just still wanted to get it out for you guys. Just a lot has been going on. Um, I will be doing a video explaining everything that's been going on. It's just been crazy. I don't know if most of you know or if you do know, I live in New York State. <laughs> and as most of you know, New York State is has been hit so hard um, by this crazy pandemic situation that we have going on. Um, I live in the country part, so we're not as affected, but we are. I do have family members um, that family and friends, you know, that has been affected by it. Um, I have a few a few friends, family friends that did pass away from it. So dealing with a lot of emotions and just, just a lot. But I know God is able and he's working. So I did not get a chance to upload these videos because priority right now is just my mental and family and friends and still trying to homeschool three kids and all that stuff. But I wanted to get this video up for you guys today. Also, this video is in participation with Tammy Webb from um, Home Decor, DIYs, and More. Um, that is the name of her channel with Home Decor, DIYs, and More with Tangi Webb. Um, that is the name of her channel. So she has challenged a few of us to organize a space in our home. I am going to be organizing my linen closet because my daughter, Nyla, she just... Every day, she goes in there and she takes everything out and just goes nuts. So, um, I'm going to be reorganizing my linen closet. Also, I'm going to be doing just a little bit of cleaning. You guys probably can see behind me. I have tons of laundry to do. Um, those are clean laundry that I have to fold and put away. My bed is not yet made and it's almost 12 o'clock and that's okay. I'm giving myself some grace. Um, and I'm doing laundry. My kids are downstairs with my husband. They're all doing um, homeschool work right now. And I'm just, I just stole away a little time to come up here and film this video and just get it all done so that I can have peace of mind at the end of the day knowing that this video is done. So I am going to be putting Tangie's um, channel link down in the description box. Make sure you guys head over to her channel. Let her know that I sent you over. Um, and check out her channel. She does a lot of DIYs, high end to low end. She does a lot of home decor cleaning videos. She does some vlogs. Um, and also she does a lot of home organization. Her cleaning videos are the bomb. Like I love her cleaning videos and organization. And I absolutely love her home. It is beautiful. Also, while you are on her channel, check out her backyard tutorial. Her and her husband just did two videos, part one, part two, on getting their backyard ready for the summer. Y'all, it's absolutely incredible. It's like straight up out of HGTV magazine. So make sure you guys go over and check those out. Check out her challenge video. Let her know that I sent you. Her home is gorgeous. She's a beautiful soul inside and out. Tangie girl, I love you. You, I feel like we've been friends for life and I literally just met you on YouTube. But I love you. I love your spirit. I love you for who you are. And thank you so much for including me in this awesome challenge. So the name of the challenge is the COVID-19 organization ideas. So without further ado, let's get into the video and yeah, show y'all how I organize my linen closet and see that I can make my bed and get this mountain of laundry done today. All right, let's do it. I do without 
Michaela's keeping her room. She's keeping it pretty clean. This is all her clothes I just folded, put on her bed. She's got to put these away in her drawer. But for the most part, she's keeping it nice and clean. So this is my linen closet, you guys, that I was telling you guys about. Um, I go through this closet organization ordeal at least two to three times a week because um, Nyla likes to go in the closet and take everything out and throw them down the steps <laughs> so it is definitely frustrating but um Michaela and Mikey always help me you know to get everything back in the closet but also because the door does not lock I don't know why I think because whoever painted it painted the top of the door and it just won't slam shut so I think I'm gonna have to um, tend to that but this is what my closet is looking like before and I will definitely take you through the process and show you what it looks like afterwards I gotta get another mat but for now it's good I put the box back with the curtains because I didn't remember that I actually did purge the things that I didn't want to use um, and those down there are winter curtains so those are in there for the winter um, I change out my curtains like seasonally so right now I have all my spring summer sheer curtains up so these are actually all of my darkening heavy wool like curtains that are in the box um, then I have some blankets my daughter's um, mattress protector I have two of them she has one on her bed right now and then that's just a backup then I have um, just the kids their bed um, sheets they're you know fitted and flat 
and then all their pillowcases are here as well. I don't keep my bedding and stuff in here. I actually keep that in my armoire. So they only have their sheets and it's on the lower level. That way it's easily accessible for them. Also, this will be for all the towels and washcloths. I have tons of towels and washcloths right now that is in the laundry being washed and sanitized. Um, and then this is for Nyla's uh, washable underpad, well, mattress underpad. Um, they're also being washed and sanitized. Then these are all my summertime shower curtains. And then those up there are my black blackout um, drapes for the winter. So I have quite a few of them. They were in the living room. I think I have about eight of them. So those are in there. So I use that for the winter time. So those are up there. I'm not going to use that again until, you know, maybe, I don't know, November, December. So those are up there. So yeah, so this is what it is looking like right now. It is more organized for today. Once Nyla sees this, because she's been watching me. <laughs> so I don't know. Once she gets in here, hopefully she doesn't. But um, this is what it looks like for today. Okay guys, so if you like this style of cleaning video where I do do some type of organization, let me know because I have plenty of closets that needs to get organized. Um, so just let me know if you guys like the style of video. Also, don't forget to go ahead and visit Tangie's channel. It's Decor and DIYs by Tangie Webb. Um, her link will be down in the description box below. You guys can go over to her channel and um, watch her videos. Subscribe to her channel as well. Don't forget to hit that bell so that you'll be notified when she does upload any videos at all. Um, and also, you guys, I just, I just want to thank y'all for all the love that I've been getting on my channel. I am super grateful for all your support, all your love, all your encouragement. I'm just, I'm in awe of God because of the blessings that um, He has bestowed upon myself and my family. Um, thank you so much for your support. Please continue to support us and let everyone that you know, um, let us know that, let them know that I am here on YouTube, Regal Designs by Shoshana. Also, you can support me by visiting my Instagram. As well, I do a lot of behind the scenes stuff on my Instagram channel. You guys will get to see stuff on there that you won't be able to see here on YouTube. Some things, some, you know, you, you'll see here on YouTube, but most of the times, a lot of the stuff I do do on Instagram, some things you won't see here on YouTube. So we're having a lot of fun over there. Make sure you guys go over and um, follow me on Instagram as well. Um, also, thank you guys so much for all your feedbacks and your communications. I just, I love talking with you guys. Um, it's, it's, I feel like you guys are not just my friends, but really you guys are my family and you're always there for me. And so I appreciate y'all so much. If this is your first time, um, coming to my channel, welcome. I would love for you to subscribe and stay and just get to know us here on YouTube. We are a beautiful community, extremely positive and uplifting and extremely inspiring bunch of people here on in my on this YouTube community platform. Um, so I would love for you to go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell, double tap it so you'll receive all my notifications. Also don't forget to share the videos, give it a thumbs up because it does help my channel out and don't forget to leave your comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are all staying well, staying safe, hashtag stay home, and enjoy your family, make memories at this time. And, you know, God has got us. He's going to get us through this time. Don't forget that he's Lord and um, that he loves you and I love you too. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Bye guys.